Hello, welcome back to PlayStation Access with me, Dave, and Holly, Hello. who is here to tell us all about Control, which is very exciting, Holly, because basically all I've seen is the trailer at the PlayStation yes. conference. I know nothing apart from it looks amazing, and it's made by Remedy. Yeah, Remedy now, are coming back to PlayStation. You've been behind closed doors, so I'm very excited to hear anything, basically, anything you can tell me. Yeah, so we actually saw a live gameplay demo. It's still relatively early gameplay, but we okay. did see something. Uh, it looked really, really cool. Now, first yeah. things first, uh, if you've played Remedy games, you know they're very sort of story-driven. Yeah. But they want to. They just want to say that with this one, they're definitely adding more gameplay elements to it. It was definitely a gameplay-heavy trailer. Yes, uh, and it, it was, and they were really, really wanted to show that. Right. So yeah, there's going to be a lot more gameplay maybe than what Remedy fans are used to seeing. Okay. Just to give it some balance. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. So you're playing as Jessie. Okay. Uh, and probably like not through maybe what she wanted. Uh, she has found herself to be the new director for the Federal Bureau of Control. Right, okay, so that's where the title comes from. Exactly. Not something that exists that I'm aware of. Uh, well, I don't think it's for people like us, let's put it that <laughs> right, way. Right, okay. Uh, reality is being invaded by an enemy called the Hiss. Right, uh, strong they, name. I, yeah, they're actually, they're really, really kind of scary. I was going to say, is there a kind of a, am I, I going to be scared? I, well, yeah, because you're like me and we're scared of everything. Yes, okay. It's more psychological thriller than horror. It's right. not a horror game. Okay. But it's got, because it's, because reality is being messed with and and, and screwed, yes. it really gets into your head. I can see that psychological element definitely. Yeah, and that's all what all it the does. changing rooms and stuff. So the history invading. Yes. So they can they can also take over people's bodies. So like the security guards and stuff that you're fighting are like possessed by the hiss. Right. Which is okay. Why they've got the movements that they do. Right. So now that you are the director of the Federal Bureau of Control. Yes. You have some really, really cool powers that have been granted to you for this reason. Okay. So the first one is the gun. Right. Now you saw him a trailer, the gun sort of breaks apart. Yeah. And from what I saw him in the gameplay, the way that the the bits of the gun mold almost changes the type of gun that you have. Okay. So she's not carrying like six different guns. Right. I think this gun... Reformats. Re rejigs itself. Yeah. yeah. A, a, its configuration then it becomes right. this or it becomes okay. that that's cool and that can be upgraded and modded as the game progresses as right. well right sure uh, and then we've also got your powers yeah now we saw in a trailer it's like telekinesis I've yeah. likened it to the telekinesis shop from Bioshock okay because um, that's the only other game I've really play I really have a strong affinity towards that I play where I'm like okay I know how this feels right so we saw two ways of using it so we saw shield, right? which is where you are literally grabbing the debris around you and bringing it up in front. Okay, yeah. And this will allow this will allow you to be protected from like the bullets from the hiss and stuff right. like that. Right, yeah. Okay, that's cool. And then we also saw launch. Right. Which unsurprisingly is you just go whoop. Nice. Uh, everything from death to fire extinguishers. I think even in the trailer, like just rips the clock off the wall and like wow. frisbees it across yeah. like into a into a bad guy and takes them down. That's amazing. It's a very yeah. Darth Vader. That's what I... I mean, yes. I will be thinking of Jedi and the Force. This is so. a lot of us. I've gone Bioshock and you've gone Jedi. Uh, yes. <laughs> uh, that is it is very, very much like that. And again, that can also be uh, modded uh, as the game progresses right. as well. Okay, that sounds cool. Uh, but you also can find these, like, artifacts. Okay. And these are, like, the very special items that are sort of hidden in the world yeah and when you bind to them you get extra abilities right so at one point we unlocked the ability to like it's not fly that's not really the right word like a hover a kind of a float yeah yeah and you could like there's like a bridge that you couldn't get over before but now you could like float over to it right and like unlock a path that previously you couldn't get to right okay and there are lots of these also to collect and, find. and so does it does it you might not know, but does it seem like you, once you have that power, it stays with you for the rest of the game? Yeah. Or are they kind of like, okay, cool. It seems like it. Or if not, I suppose you just equip and unequip as you needed. Got you. But they were literally just like, yeah, we've got this power now and we just go up to this ledge and it just, yeah. the, float, the, lev the levitation just happens. I will float everywhere, just yeah. so you know. I mean, you, I think you, like, you've got that psychological. Yeah. I mean, the bodies were floating. Uh, yeah, absolutely. They can do their thing. Yeah. So the main game, all of the game, actually takes place inside the Federal Bureau of Control. It's okay. like your HQ. But you saw in the trailer, all the blocks were shifting and moving. Yeah. And that's basically what it is. It makes that HQ a hub. Right. So it might be that you're on a certain path. So you're doing, you've picked up a mission. Yeah. And you're on the path down this corridor. 
but then when you come back things will have reshifted and like maybe new paths have opened okay and maybe because it's such a you know a, a psychological game that you might go down a path and open a door but then you're not in the building anymore this is going to be really else. i can see how this is going to be really interesting and we talked about the, the psychological elements of it yeah. like you know a lot of games you get to know the map or whatever you remember your way back to somewhere yeah. if you're coming back and it's all changed that's going to be very interesting and like kind of second guessing yourself and never knowing what's around a corner anymore because exactly you haven't been there before exactly that also makes it quite sandboxy yeah because a couple of paths might open you'd be like right well i'm gonna do this one right now even though like maybe the main mission wants me to go this way yeah. actually i'm going down this path to yeah. see what you find and there are side quests right okay we were going past like a controlled like test lab yeah a bit like the beginning of prey okay yeah you prey right yeah uh and like this is a person like stuck in one of these rooms like and for some reason he's not allowed to like take his eyes off this like fridge okay and he's like oh my god there's somebody here like can you help me can you help me that like, you I, I can't leave like i can't take my eyes off this you need to help and you're like as you're walking away you're like i'm really really sorry like i promise i'll come back and he's like screaming after you and oh, that's no. a side mission that you could have picked up right okay but we were like no no we have to keep going we have to keep going keep looking at the fridge though yeah like have a nice back. fridge don't let that fridge move have a nice fridge. have a nice fridge yeah okay that's that's um that's very interesting side quest i wasn't getting that kind of vibe that's that's yeah, cool that's, they're basically trying to say there's more gameplay here than there has been right. really in previous film games but story is still key that is yes. who remedy are that is not changing yeah it's a third person action adventure exactly like you're used to from them well i really love that they've got the director on the ground you know like yeah. doing the kicking some ass oh her, definitely herself because you know that needs needs to happen that's what well, everyone should employees. leave from the front well thank you so much for uh, letting us know what you found out that has actually filled out quite a lot of blanks for me mm. uh it looks like an amazing game it looks really really interesting like visually stunning um so looking forward to finding out more about that although it does sound a bit too scary for me we'll so, play it together well, with the lights on <laughs> don't people will ask for that uh speaking of which let us know in the comments below what you think of uh control how you think it's shaping up like this video if you liked it and do subscribe so you don't miss anything else from the world of playstation